I love the class sizes at the Mount. Having small class sizes is where I've always been most comfortable. Um, so I had tried the big high school thing and coming to the Mount just felt like home. I chose it mostly because the 2 plus 2 program. Uh, I was a student at NSCC and this uh, was a great kind of step to, to further my education. I've been able to keep a full-time job while uh, doing my courses through distance, which would not have been possible at any other school. It had a great route for me be coming in as a mature student and saying that I didn't have to do the co-op route, I could come in as a practica. Um, it also acknowledged a lot of my prior work experience and you know prior education as well. I decided to go to Dubai because Mostly it was on the other side of the world. Since it's so international, I knew that it would be a good place for tourism as well. It's nice just to blend with other cultures and see how other people look at certain situations and their outlook on things. The professors are super helpful, super nice. You can go to them anytime that you need to and they're just all around good people. They've helped me in, in developing as, as a person and, uh, and in my career from, from helping with marketing and branding to, uh, to, to speaking in front of people. Uh, I remember when I first got to the Mount, I, I wouldn't even get in front of a class of 15 to talk and, and, um, and now I'm, I'm talking in front, of, um, in front of conferences and conventions in, in, in our industry. The tourism program is constantly connecting you into the industry, whether or not it's uh, volunteer activities or networking. Uh, the Learning Passport program as well, uh, that integrates you into the industry all the time. Uh, so you're just doing tours of hotels or restaurants, you're constantly out there in the community. One extracurricular activity that has helped me to succeed in the tourism program has been the Team Kitchen Party. It was a dinner that a lot of industry members grouped together to in support of tourism education to meet students one-on-one -on -one and see what they can provide them with. You have to participate and the more you participate in these things, the more you get more, more knowledgeable about you know, the industry. One of the great things about the Mountains Tourism Program is that all students have the opportunity to complete either the co-op or the practical program and gain up to one year of related experience before graduating. We actually heard from tourism graduates that within three months of graduating, 90% of the students received employment in their field of study. The co-op office has helped me by preparing me for interviewing, working on my resume, making me super comfortable in my interviews. I go in really confident and it's thanks to them. The most exciting thing about my co-op jobs would probably be just the hands-on experience and knowing what it's like in the real world. Um, it gives you a taste of what it's like after school and where I plan to be in the future. Now that I've graduated, I stay in touch with the Mount through, uh, through their co-op program actually by employing some of their co-op students. We do have a management readiness program, so if we have a, an associate who's looking for some development so that they can prepare for management, we can walk them through some training programs they can take online, we'll help coach them and set up a planning, like a, a development plan for them. Tourism is a very important part of the Nova Scotia economy. It's going to be a more important part of the Nova Scotia economy going forward. It's, it, it is an area where there is, will be business opportunities uh, for young entrepreneurs, and there is an area where there will be continued to be job growth.